Hello everyone and welcome back to Supermarket Simulator. So last episode we left off just restocking and adding some stuff to the store. We got the new license for the fridge stuff. So we are on, geez, I don't even know what day, does it tell me anywhere what day we're on? I want to say we're on like day four right now. Like right now, right here, right now. Um, so I think what I'm going to go ahead and do is restock some of the stuff. Uh, let's see, I've got two things of pasta left over. We'll go ahead and trash that box. Um, I'm gonna order a box of oil, gonna get things restocked. I'm gonna run through the day, hopefully get a bit more money, and then we can kinda take it from there. The big thing that I would really like to get done today is going to be getting this expansion now we're already a level four, but we don't have enough money. We need another like $120 to be able to afford that. So yeah, we should get there. We should definitely get there pretty quickly. I would very much like to get at least two of the expansions because I think one is going to be that section right there. And then the second one is going to be that half of the section right there. And then I can start putting together some aisles because you know me, your girl, she loves her aisles. So I'm going to go ahead, get this stuff going, and I'll bring you guys back for the end of day report. Okay, so our last customer of the day just left, and we had 25 total customers, 175 points. We made a bunch of cash. Not too bad. Um, the thing is, we need to be a level 7 to get that other uh, upgrade for the store. So I think I'm going to go ahead, just purchase this one, get it out of the way. Oh, we need to be a level 6? Oh, well, we're almost there. Okay, so then, yeah, uh, probably halfway with... Um, Halfway through the day to, to today, we should be able to get this next section unlocked. Oh, right. Okay. Totally forgot. Totally forgot this one's different. So I'm going to need to get three. Okay. Well, we got the first one. We're definitely going to need these next two. Uh, with the rate we're going, I mean, we'll definitely be able to afford that. No problem. It's really just getting the store points to get the customers in here. And uh, and and yeah, just just the levels is what's holding us back right now, which, you know, we'll, we'll be okay. We'll definitely get there. So I'm going to go ahead, do this again, run through the day, bring you guys back at the end of it, and we'll see where we're at. Okay, yet another day has gone by, and we are on day five. We got 26 customers, made a bunch of money, and we are still not quite at level 7. So I cannot get this, or sorry, level 9. So I cannot get this, sex, this second section here. So I'm going to keep pushing, but I think what I'm going to end up doing for right now is um, rotating some of these things around. And just get started on getting the shape of our aisles put in. And I think I'm going to have them start at that board right there. And I think that that should be wide enough for me to get through without too much hassle. We're going to go ahead, rotate these guys around here a little bit. Um, we're going to get this one. We're going to put this, let's see, right there on that line. Yeah, that feels like it's got plenty of room inside of there. That is fine. Um, now, as you can see, we still have that objective to buy a fridge or a shelf. So what I'm going to end up doing is getting this license right here. And then we're going to go into the market. Go to furnitures. We're going to grab our shelf, which is going to take care of that objective. And then we're going to get all of our new products. So we've got peanut butter. We have new flour. We have olive oil, pasta, rice, and salt. So let's go ahead, order up all that stuff. And now I have to figure out how I'm going to have everything placed in the store here. Um, let's see. We've got... Nope, that's not a shelf. I need my shelf. Okay, let's go ahead and put the shelf in. And line it up right there. Perfect. Okay. So I think what I'm going to do is move my pasta and have it back over here. So we'll go ahead and put... Oh, wait. Hold on. I want that on the second shelf down. So we'll start the pasta over here. Um, it's not the right size box. That's fine. We can use our smart pocket boxes. 
and just get that moved over. All right, and then we need this one. Get that put over here. Okay, now we can throw out that box. We're gonna take, let's see, our other box of spaghetti. We're gonna place that over here, carry that across. And now we have our new flower, which is gonna go over here. And the other box of flour goes right here. And then our olive oil, nope, that's rice. Okay, so the rice is gonna come over here with the pasta. Fantastic, all right, get the second box in. Beautiful. And now our olive oil is gonna go right down here. And we'll go ahead and get this one in. And now our peanut butter is actually gonna go over here with our cereal. So I'm going to take our sugar and I'm gonna move it over here with our coffee and our tea. And obviously this is just going to be temporary until we get more products, more expansions, and more shelves. And then I will definitely redo the, um, the shelving stuff here. So I'm gonna go ahead and put the peanut butter down here because I know eventually we're gonna get a honey and another bread. So that bread is gonna come up uh, beneath the cereal. So let's go ahead and throw that box away. We'll grab our peanut butter, put it over here. Fantastic. And now we're gonna take a box and we're gonna move the bread up a shelf. So right there, perfect. Okay, all right, so we don't have any more objectives. We took care of that. Um, I'm going to go through, restock what we've got already, and run through yet another day, see where we're at point-wise. Hopefully, with the new license, we'll get some more customers, but we shall see. Okay, the end of yet another day. We had 25 customers, made a bit more money, and we're level 7 and just a little extra. So let's see here. If I were to come into paints... <gasps> We do have paints available to us. Okay, 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 okay. Uh, some interesting colors. It's also kind of expensive, $200 per bucket. Now, how does one paint? Okay, so I'm, I don't know what color this is. I feel like it's gray. I'm gonna go ahead and buy that. Let's see here. Um, okay, I don't know. <laughs> uh, first of all, I don't know what that is. Uh, second of all, I don't know where my paint went to. I, uh, huh. Oh, hey, the sign is different. Oh, it actually pops out. That's really cool. Uh, yeah. Okay. So definitely no paint. I just spent $200 on something that disappeared. Um, oh, the flooring. Let's see, I kinda like this one. Let's see, do I get the flooring? Let's go ahead and purchase that. No, no, okay. Okay, there might be an issue with one of the mods. Let me back out of here, see if there's an issue with the mod, and then we'll take it from there. Okay, so it looked like uh, there was an update for Delivery Organizer, and I went ahead, updated that file, and I just ordered some flooring and some paint. And now we have a paint can. Uh, how does one do this? Oh, I just click on the wall? Oh, click and hold. Okay. Ooh. All right. I like this. Okay, that did the whole wall section right there. So let's go ahead and... Now, does this bucket... Oh, yeah. Okay, the paint is definitely going down. I'm going to need another bucket. Oh, there's no board paint. Okay. Well, we'll throw that out. We'll grab our new flooring. How much flooring do we have? Oh, I don't think I like it. Yeah, I don't think I like it. That's okay. We can change it again some other time. We're just going to deal with it for now. Okay. You don't get a whole lot of flooring per box either. Oh, man. Okay. Well, ooh, I really do like the white paint. 
I really feel like that really just sort of opens up the whole thing. That looks really, really good. I am quite pleased with that. So I think going forward, I'm not going to do this wall section here. I'm not going to do this wall section here. I'm only going to do this section and that section because I feel like once we start um, upgrading the sections, it might get rid of the paint. I mean, we're going to have to wait and find out, but I feel like that might be a thing. Um, let's see. How close are we to going to get that next upgrade? You know what? Let's just go ahead and get it. Oh, it's over there. Well, that's fine. <laughs> That's totally fine. All right, so it's going to be that section, and then once we get that section, it will start uh, expanding over here from what I remember, if I'm correct. But yeah, okay. Well, uh, I guess I have a bit more of restocking to do. Um, let's see. How close are we to the next license? Level 9 for the next license, which means we're going to need another fridge. Um, and then let's see level nine for that next section. And I mean, we're pretty close to being able to afford it. We just need the levels. I think I'm going to power through a little bit more, um, try to get some more levels in here. And I will bring you guys back as soon as we're able to get that next section. And then maybe hopefully the other license as well. All right. Oh, no. Okay. I was going to end the day, but it looks like we just got two more customers. We've got Thick44 and Revealing Shirt Lady. And you're first. All right. Let's go ahead. Cash you out. 38 bucks. Fantastic. How about you, Tony? Mr. Schnur. What you buying? All right. A couple of different items. Fantastic. Dollar and change. There we go. All right. So not too bad. We're almost a level eight. I think another day or two we'll be at level nine. We'll definitely be able to finally look at getting into that next license as well as getting this next section, which will open that up for us, which I'm pretty excited about because the more space we have in the store, the more I can utilize it properly. Um, and I am thinking about bringing back the end cap refrigerators, getting the small refrigerators and then having just like bottles of water in front of them. I'm not quite sure yet. Um, it is something I have been considering, but for now, we're going to go with what we've got. I'm not going to try to think too far ahead right now. Um, just sort of go with the flow a little bit here. Now, I do have to do some restocking. Uh, no, coffee is good. Let's see. I've got a box of flour back here. I'm really looking forward to getting the uh, storage room and some shelving in there. Actually... I can go ahead and get the storage room and I can get the next section of storage room as well. Okay, I'll take that. All right, so let's pop back over to the market, go over to furnitures and there should be storage racks. There's two different storage racks. Okay, we've got tall and we have the small. I feel like maybe the tall would probably be the way to go. Well, let's buy one and see how that works out for us. Oh, I can't until the morning. Okay, so let's go ahead and end our day. Hey, we're up to 30 customers. So that's pretty good. Getting that new license gave us a little bit of a boost here. All right, let's go ahead and buy that shelf or the rack rather. Oh, it's kind of a tight squeeze back here. Okay, can I put you, where can I put you? Okay, right there. All right. Oh, wow, that thing is tall. Holy crap, that goes right up to the ceiling. Okay. Um, now, I am wondering if I got the more re or the cloned restockers mod, if that would work here. Uh, you know what? We're gonna we're gonna check that out. Let's give it a try. Okay, so we're going to pop into management, go over to hiring and see, okay, we have to be a level 15 before we can buy our first restocker. But if I were to hit shift H, are you picking boxes up off of the floor? What are you doing? What you doing, man? Okay, 
How about I go put that onto a shelf? Are you broken? Oh boy, I think he might be, oh, he might be broken. All right, let's go ahead and just start putting things onto the shelf and see how he does. Very curious to see if he actually does work or if there's going to be a huge issue with him. Are my box is closing. Yeah, they are. Okay. All right, let's grab our eggs. Okay, we've got everything up on the racks, um, but he is looking a little bit perplexed. So we're going to fire him. We're going to hire a new guy and see how he does. All right, so he's definitely walking into the stock room. He's getting a box. I feel like his texture got changed. He looks extra shiny. Okay. All right. And now are you going to throw the box away? You are. All right. Okay. Okay. Yeah. So that looks like it's working pretty well for us, which is great. That's going to make my life a little bit easier as I have to continue to cashing out people. I'm going to go through and I'm going to order up stuff that I need and I will bring you guys back at the end of the day. Okay, so, uh, yeah, he does not, he does not understand how to carry boxes from the curb, so more cloned restockers is definitely kind of broken. Um, yeah, not great, not great, so we're gonna go ahead, fire this guy, because he seems like he is incredibly confused. How do I not have rock space? Oh, crap, my cash register is full of people so let's go ahead cash these folks out um yeah a little bit disappointing that that one is uh broken hopefully they'll put out an update and fix it um but we'll have to wait and see so i'm gonna go ahead finish up my day here try to get some more uh racks in the storage room so i have more places to put all the products and i might hire a restocker again um, just to, to take care of that aspect of running the store. Um, and then when we hit level 15, I'll hire a legitimate restocker and see how that goes for us. But I don't think that that is going to be a this episode type of thing. So yeah, but let me go ahead, continue running through the day and I'll bring you guys back. All right. So we are on day nine and we did pretty good. Definitely did pretty good. I went ahead, bought another can of paint. I painted the front of the store. I think it looks pretty good. And I'm not sure, you know, with the, the this flooring, this flooring, I feel like it belongs in a hospital and maybe not necessarily a grocery store. But um, we're at the point now where we should have enough money to get a fridge buy all the products and get this license here. And we might have enough to get the other section of the, um, of that level license. So I'm going to go ahead, pop into the market. We're going to go to furniture. Now I really would like to try out these new fridges, but I think I'm going to use those just for the cheese. I'm not sure, I'm not sure. I definitely would like to try it out, but I think I'm just gonna use it for the cheese. Um, let's see here. And then we have, okay, this fridge right here is the one I'm gonna go for. Uh, I don't wanna buy it just yet. I want to go into the management. I have to actually get the license because I, I may have forgotten to do that. And now we can go into products, go to fridge, buy four of those. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, and four. Okay. Yeah. And we still have some, uh, we're going to go ahead and fire these guys. Okay. And we still have some money left over, which is fantastic. I don't know why I took that. I need the fridge first. Um, and I think what we're going to do is we're just going to put these fridges right over here for now. And that should be just fine. Okay. So let's grab our soda. Um, let's see. We've got two juices and a couple of different sodas. So we'll put the white cola up here. Perfect. Okay. We have our orange juice. All right. We have more orange juice. This is going to have to go into the stock room. 
I think I need another rack. Oh boy. Yeah, I also need to or organize the rack itself actually. So huh, let's see here. Okay, I'm going to buy another rack. I'm going to get some things organized. I'm going to get things put away. And I'll bring you back in just a second. Okay, we ran through an entire day. I haven't had a chance to restock things, which is why we have a product not found. Because I've been very busy trying to get things somewhat organized back here in our uh, closet of chaos. Um, so I think what I need to do is actually buy another rack. I did not have enough money to do that earlier. I now have enough money to do that. So we're going to go ahead, grab another tall rack. And I'm, I'm so glad that we have restockers because trying to reach the top shelf of the tall rack is an absolute nightmare. And what's interesting is you can place these kind of inside of each other. So there is a little bit more forgiving, which I am definitely a fan of. Uh, we need to get our pasta up here. And I did not put in my spaghetti yet. So let's go ahead and move all this stuff down shelf right here. And then this can go down here. And then that can come right over here. And now I just have to get my spaghetti in here and let's go ahead and start loading up the sodas. Uh, let's see, did I put that one in? I did. All right, so we'll go ahead and put this one on the other side. Okay, um, what did I, oh, I'm missing spaghetti. Right, so let's go back over to products, uh, scroll down to the spaghetti. We'll grab a couple of boxes. I know you had no space. I haven't put you anywhere yet. Oh, uh, fake milk. Okay, let's just grab our spaghetti. Um, and I messed up this shelf here. Crap. Because I have to have that flower over here. Okay, so we're going to move everything down by one. Carry that over. Grab, grab this out of that shelf and very carefully get it up there. Okay, there, uh, nope. We'll just delete that and then we'll L that up top there. Okay, um, which means we're gonna have to move everything over. Oh, you know what? Forget it. We're just putting the spaghetti down here. It's fine. It's fine. I don't have the patience to deal with this right now. When it comes time to do a full restock room overhaul, I'll worry about it. But for right now, it doesn't matter. Does not matter in the slightest. Okay, so let's grab this soda. I'm going to stick that over here. And we need our green soda. That can go right there. And did I put my fake milk in? I don't think I did. All right, hold on. Let me zerp that up. Uh, the fake milk, that's going to have to come in here and get put in here somewhere. We'll just put it down here for now. All right, and zerp everything up that we can. Um, I don't have a spot for the sugar. Oh, boy. Okay, well, we'll put the sugar right there. That's fine. Okay, so, I mean, at least our stock room is looking a little bit uh, better. Not perfect, but better. Going to go ahead, do a little bit of reordering or um, ordering for restock purposes. Let's see, we've got one box here. We'll go ahead and do that. We'll grab another box of that, another two boxes of the cheese. That stuff was selling like crazy. And one more each of the sodas. Okay, and then we can go through, order everything, and now I can hire my restockers we'll get four that seems to be a pretty good balance for right now and then the next thing i want to do is actually change out my flooring now i don't know if this is carpet and it looks a bit busy i'm not sure how that one's gonna look um so i think i might i was gonna say i might stick with the wood you know what let's grab one and see how it looks Go ahead and grab that. How does that look? Like carpet. Yeah, that looks like carpet. Can I rebox this? No, I can't. Okay, so I'll see this. 
Can I sell it? I cannot sell it. Okay, so I'm going to have to put down the last bit. Okay, box is empty. And I can't hit T to throw it out. I have to walk to the trash can with that one. Okay. Uh, all right. Well, in that case, I might just stick with the hospital floor. I think that one might have looked a little bit better. I'm not a huge fan of that design. So I'm going to grab a couple boxes. Let's see. We'll grab five. It's going to leave me with almost no money, but it, it'll, be, it'll be okay. It'll be fine. All right, let's just try to do what we can with what we've got. Okay, it's far from being done and it's far from perfect, but at least it's sort of coming together. Like if we just look at the store from right here, it doesn't look too bad. <laughs> but that is going to do it for this episode, guys. Thank you so much for coming to hang out with me today while I putz around with some of the new stuff that's been added to Supermarket Simulator. I really appreciate every single last one of you for taking the time to watch my videos. And if I haven't said it already, I love you guys to absolute bits. Thank you so much for your continued support. And I can't wait to see you all next time.